chicken salad veronique it's like chicken salad but elevated to party food i thought michael and jim would really like it so the first thing i did was i roasted chicken breasts olive oil salt and pepper for 35 minutes at 350 degrees and it really makes the chicken so much moister than poaching it let it cool a little bit take the skin off so i'm just going to cube this i don't want it too small but i want Sort of bite-sized pieces are perfect. I'm gonna just right into the bowl. Chicken's still a little warm, which is a great way to make the salad, and then it really absorbs the flavor. Once it's cold, it's firmer, and it doesn't absorb the flavor so much. So chicken salad Veronique, I think, comes from probably Sole Veronique, which is classically made with grapes. Chicken has so much more flavor when it's roasted than it does when it's poached. There's something about the water that just takes all the flavor out of it. And there's something about the olive oil, salt, and pepper that gives it flavor. So I think for tonight, I'm going to do four chicken breasts. OK, now for the sauce. So first, half a cup of mayonnaise. I'm just going to put it right into the bowl and toss it all together. OK, now some green things. So fresh tarragon, which is a really sort of delicate herb. One and a half tablespoons of fresh tarragon leaves. This really is the place for fresh herbs. I'm just going to chop it up. Mm, it smells wonderful. I think it's a really underused herb, tarragon. OK, the next thing is celery in the category of lots of green things. I'm going to run my knife right down the middle. Leave it attached on the top. And just chop it up. OK, right in. I'll do two stalks of celery. It's about one cup of celery. But the good news is you can do as much as you like. That should be just about one cup. And now comes the Veronique part, green grapes. So I need about one cup of green grapes cut in half. I want to make sure you use seedless grapes. Nobody wants to be crunching their chicken salad. <laughs> this salad will sit very well, too, because all the flavors, the tarragon will really get into the chicken and the sweetness of the grapes. OK, that's it for the grapes. A little salt and pepper, one and a half teaspoons of salt. I know it sounds odd to have salt and grapes together, but it really brings out the flavor of them. One teaspoon of pepper, toss it all together, and that's chicken salad marinade.